doing that smoky grindy thing again. That doesn't seem good. The better I'd come down. Don't try anything clever. We got a lot to do today. Uh, it takes too long to recover from the spanker. Engine. Things and go. You're not in the center, are you? Fuck you, old man. This is no way for an apprentice to behave. Come on over here, and I'm packing a tree. I fucking stuck. It just hit me once. Fuck me. Alright. Are you ready for another day of serving people? I mean, uh, serving the people, of course. <laughs> My little chick. Never mind. You always gotta beat the shit out of them then, huh? Grindy thing again. That doesn't sound good. The better I'd come down. Don't try anything clever. We've got a lot to do today. Uh, it takes too long to recover from the spanker. People are starving! Do you understand? We are witch! <laughs> So it hits me once and I fucking go down, pretty much, huh? How in the fuck do I do this thing? Are you ready for another day of serving people? I mean, uh, serving the people, of course. Jesus Christ! Can I skip this little fucking stupid garbage here? I can jump, but I can't fucking... Thing again. That doesn't seem good. The better I'd come down. Don't try anything clever. We've got a lot to do today. Uh, it takes too long to recover from the spanker. So you keep saying, but. Because I can't lock the door? Okay. What? Alright. Are you ready for another day of serving people? I mean uh serving the people. Shut up. Grindy thing again. That doesn't seem good. The better I'd come down. Don't try anything clever. We've got a lot to do today. Uh, it takes too long to recover from the spanker. Killing this guy does not seem like such a bad, bad idea now. In all honesty, it's probably like the fifth time I've tried this. Starting to piss me off. Maybe let's not grab our stuff. Okay, let's take a look around, see where the fuck I can go from here. So, spanker, spanker. Spanker, spanker. Huh? Heavens. This is clogged up something proper. There's really nowhere for me to fucking leave once I get out here, huh? 
Like, I can't, I can't just leave, I gotta, like, fucking take him down or something. And the spankers can't hit him. Right? Yeah, there's nowhere for me to fucking run to. You're not in the center, are you? Of course not. Can't save the game right now. That's too bad. No way for an apprentice to behave. Do I just have to like get out while he's looking for me or something? Come now. Most of the coming behavior. I can't take him out. It's dumb. Because we can just kind of stay behind him then. Note, my dearest Mata, I don't know if I've ever said, if I'll have, if you'll. I know I will never send this letter, but I can't help myself. I must write to you, even if you're no longer, even alive, or if I am. We live in a world of absurdity, most absurd things. Okay, what is this? Okay, this was unimportant. Get the fuck out of here. What's going on up there? I heard shouting. Where's Rich? Mr. Cutty's turning cadavers into V-meat. I barely escaped becoming V-meat myself. He's got these horrible machines in there that turn people into meat bunt cake. Human bunt cake? That's, that's monstrous. Is he armed? He has a rather nasty spanker, but I think he's a bit trapped in the cellar at the moment. Right. We'll knock out the power. Go spank him ourselves. Thank you, citizen. We'll take it from here. You can't do this to me! I'm a pillar of the community! It's all lies! I never! Those are all perfectly legitimate machines! I'm only trying to feed people! We're letting perfectly good meat go rotten! That's insane! Did you give thought to becoming a vegetarian? Yeah. Uh, okay. The Slaughterer's Apprentice. Achievement unlocked. Finish all the Butcher Apprentice quests. Okay. Well, that was a fucking thing. Excuse me. Okay. I have it right here. It's equipped. I'm dumb. Never mind. I thought I was missing something. I was not. I guess let's get some more health. Excellent. Alright, well. That was definitely a thing. Okay. Oh. I failed that quest because I set off a revolver. Well, that's dumb as fuck. Anyhow, let's do this quest next. You can't just wave a weapon about. I wish you would have kind of told me, uh... I don't have a weapon out. What are you talking about? But I need to, like, toggle it or something? Officers? Lady? We all good? Okay. Hello? Hello? Captain Lawrence? I've got a message for you, sir. Captain Lawrence, sir?
In a container, or not, on top or below something high in a commercial required. What? Let me ring the bell first. Oh, we're breaking in now, boys. Let's go. I don't think that's his, um, brother. Looks a little young to be his brother. I was trying to drink the tap. Dumb. Honey! Grapefruit juice. Excellent. And pure water. Early bird. Sleep gives slightly more health. Nice. That's not a good sign. Oh, that's really bad. Sorry to bother. I know I'm not. Please don't struggle. These people probably fucking killed this old man. Yep, they definitely broke in here. How dare they? of a grateful nation. Wasn't there a guy somewhere who was roaming around? Better from the Lord's Fair. Dear Uncle Edward, now that you care, but Papa is dead. Well, dying anyway. The casket's already arrived. Though... Through entre nous, it was dearer than it ought to have been. No one listens to me. You should not expect anything in Papa's will, you know why. I'm only writing to ensure you won't have the audacity to come to his funeral as the family still cannot forgive you for the cruel theft of his beloved dog. Hmm. Aww. 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 What a good pupper. So yeah, this, this brother's dead. Oh man. Oh, Read his journal. Can we not forgive and forget now that we're both in our twilight? It's half a century ago that we brought bony Prince Charles across the channel from the horrible trenches of France. I know you loved him as I did, and that I was wrong to steal him from your garden and keep him from you for all those years. What you perhaps did not know was that I also loved Sarah. Yes, your Sarah. Did she ever tell you that I had proposed? I never spoke of it again, but when she preferred you to me, I went out of my mind with jealousy and grief. I suppose part of me wanted to make you hurt as I did. But looking back, I think I stole Charlie because I needed someone in my life to love. You've had a large loving family all these years. All I had was bony Prince Charlie for all his few remaining years. And then nothing but loneliness and longing since. Can you not see it in your heart to forgive your poor brother in your final days, knowing that you've had so much love and family in your life? Your brother Edward. P.S. I hope I have the courage to send this. I'm sure I wrote on a piece of paper, not a journal, then, my dude. Serious letter. Dear Colonel, how do you like those apples? Someone murdered him. Huh. New flash. Electronic trudgeon and a safe. Hmm. Did not mean to jump, but okay. Yeah, someone definitely uh oh, please just lie there. Shut up, my dude. You didn't see nothing. I can't get it that way. Well, that was a uh a thing, huh? Sorry, I thought my eye, I was getting it out. 
Oh, I guess we'll go back up here and tell the poor chap the bad news. Oh, there's apparently just an apothecary up here. I want to check that out real quick, actually, while, while we're on our way up towards that particular direction. One more over. Old. Shop right here. Excellent. What can I do for you today? Hello. Oh, do you have any exotic pharmaceuticals? The old top shelf. Oh, I might. I might. <laughs> oh, you should have seen me back in the day. I used to be the city's leading supplier of the uh, top shelf goods. Before very lot poached my top shelf girl, <laughs> I have been trying to brew a little something. I've an idea for an antidote for the fog. That would be handy. Thing is, I need samples. One from Amlin Village, one from the Garden District. Oh, I'd go myself, but oh, you know how it is running ah. a shop. <laughs> busy, busy. Do you think you could get me some samples? Or I'd give you the recipe for me fog antidote, and, well, I do have a few bottles left on the old top shelf <laughs> from back in the day. Just take this device into a patch of fog and let it go all the way through its cycle. You might want to wear a gas mask. <laughs> so I just take this fog sucker into a patch of pea soup, wait for it to cycle, and then bring blood samples back to you. There you go. <laughs> a word to the efficient is sufficient. Simple enough. What do you have to sell? What's your fancy? <gasps> Chem upgrade. I would like one of those, please. I'll grab three of those for now. What else you got? Chlorine. What is chlorine used for? And why am I buying one of them? Also, this I'll buy as well. And vinegar, I'll buy one as well. I feel like I'm able to like craft things once I learn how to make them. For some reason, I don't know. Anyway, time to sell. <laughs> Fuck, what did I just sell? Um, what did I sell to you? Proper shoes. I want those back. Thank you. They're my shoes. I can't part with them. Vinegar. Got all that. Got all that. All that. All that. All that. Hmm. Do I have any? Eh, I don't have any scotch. I don't think to sell. I think everything else I want to keep. Okay. I'll be open now. Thank you, sir. So that was a uh, good excursion, I suppose. Now then, off we go. Uh, two roads, then left. Here? Yep. Yeah. Is there really a dig spot in his front yard? Yeah, this was not here when I had Ed. So as soon as you get the dig spot paper, you learn where the dig spot's at, it appears. Or else I would have saw this before. Uh, Undertaker. Increase corpse carrying and movement speed. Excellent. What are you doing in my house? Oh, fuck off. I'll just kill you all if I need to. to make you feel better. You won't get away. You can't hide forever. I mean, yeah, I can. Brother. I'm afraid I'll, I've been to his house. So I was too late. How? Uh, an accident. With a bookcase. Ah, oh, shit. Shit. What's the use? I meant to talk to him sooner. I wrote him so many letters. Maybe I should have sent them. No, sir. Thank you, sir. I, uh, I don't suppose you found a footlocker there? A footlocker? No. I left a footlocker in his house. 
I'd rather you have it. That's very kind of you. Um, where is it? Regret. It's what makes us human, son. Don't forget that. No, oh, sir. Thank you, sir. So it's somewhere with a dog, I'd assume. Ooh, a military jacket. A uh, British army officer's jacket worn with a pair of British army trousers. This makes a man resemble a British army officer. Nice. Colonel Lieutenant Antique Rifle. An old rifle. Seems too fragile to use, but would look impressive over the mantelpiece. Okay. Sovereigns. Some random gear and stuff. Okay. Well, I think this might fit, actually. I'd need the trousers. Oh! He just died. I'll take your onion. Dad's dead. Who are you? Who are you? Don't make me just walking outside his house. Okay. And let's go. Stupid fuck me, fuck off. Wrong one. No. Yeah. I can't see you, but I know you're there. Well, then I guess you don't really know I'm there, huh, do you? Maybe you're here and shit. Doc! How about that? There's supposed to be a footlocker somewhere around here. Ah, fuck you, metal shutters. Get out of here. You ain't gonna time for that shit. I figured it would have been near the dog or something, you know? Is not a second tier to this house? I guess not. Oh. That actually, uh, makes a lot of sense. I guess there is a second tier, it's just hidden. Huh. Breaker. Melee attacks have a small chance of breaking the target's weapon. Nice. Oh. Can I disarm this? No? Shit. This is gonna fucking tickle then, huh? Got it. Hidden stash. A lightning rod, a canteen, a bigger banger, a banger, military pants. Oh, can join the army. As an officer of this. Huh? Europe. This kind of shows what the uh, the front was. Is that right? I suppose I, I sort of am a bit. Yeah, yes, I, I'm definitely with the resistance. Are you the new recruit? Y yeah, yeah, I, uh, uh, not that long ago. Feels like a while, though. Uh, they call me Striker. Are you ready for a mission? Where are you? We need you to rescue Peachy Carnahan. He was captured trying to infiltrate the secret lair of the evil Dr. Belloc. Oh. God, it's that loony in the treehouse. I'm talking to Johnny Bolton, aren't I? 
Special Operations Executive? The lad with all the dolls? It's all not in the resistance. Just get off his channel! <sighs> so much for the resistance. The resistance is futile, achievement unlocked. Talk to Johnny Bolton from the secret radio room. Ah, <laughs> oh, boy. Well. Ah! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That, uh, let me just say that started the shit out of me. <laughs> I'll kick his ass. How dare you? That's my flesh. Rude as fuck. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. And damn. What the fuck? Nothing to see here. Is it because I fucking knocked these people out or something? What the fuck happened? While I was out here. Damn. What? He literally just walked out of here. Nothing to see here. Don't know why you put that inside, but okay. Jesus Christ. I was not expecting the doctor to be right there as I fucking turned. Holy hell. Oof. Oof. Okay. Um. Return to Lionel Castier. Um. I need to collect fog, which I think, uh. Would be over like around here and uh, down here, right? Yeah, and there's also the fucking honey. Oh shit, we have more dig locations. Huh. Damn, okay. Well, um. Why don't we. Fuck, I don't know. I don't know. How much time we got? Okay, that much. What else we got for, uh. Quests at the moment. I guess we got the two musketeers. Mm. Yeah, we do. Okay, let's do that. Actually, no. Let's let's use this rather than walking all the way up there. How about that? Sound good? Sound good. We can also drop off our garbage. Yeah. Ah, oh, fond memories carrying from the bombs with Mum, Dad, and Percy. You know. It's a uh, very good thing that I actually read that flavor text on that rifle. Or else I would not have known to actually uh, hang the rifle above the whole thing, you know? I'd have just been like, oh, okay. This is a rifle. But uh, yeah, anyway. Let us store our garbage items. Just, just put it anyway. Fuck it, get out of here. Banger, banger. Uh, get rid of these torches. Scotch, the antiseptic, the uh, moldy bread, rancid soup. No, it's just normal stew. Get rid of the rotten meat. Get rid of this bottle. The enhanced rocks. Get them out of here right now. These dirty things. 28 fucking joy pills, god damn. At least they don't weigh anything, that's nice, you know? Um... Adrenas... is tism thing. Okay. Increases the rate of stamina regeneration for a short time. Feet. Well... Okay, um... What's this pill? Next to mine, right. Okay. Well then. I think that's everything, pretty much. Let's uh, let's not pick that up because we know it's in it now. I'm actually quite glad that we uh, never once partook in the victory meat. Never once. I never once ate it. I don't think. I don't remember, actually, I'll be real honest, but I feel like we didn't. So... I feel like we good. We didn't eat people. 
eat this potato and drink this uh, tea. Think he out? What? Or failing that, some tea to make me throw up. What? How? Is that tea bad? Oh. Get the fuck out of my goddamn inventory. Where's my sick up tea? This one? Yo! I think we're jolly good, right? Yes? Okay. Now I just need to eat and drink again. Because I fucked my day up. Okay. There we go. Excellent. Well, let's go talk to Sally, shall we? I'll do the other running around quests here later when we're not actually doing anything. Alright! Alright! Okay, I don't know why he's standing there, if I can literally go back here. Someone smells naughty. Well, maybe you should smell yourself, motherfucker. I'm getting a lot of healing supplies from him. I like that. Here comes a downer. Sally's flat. I can hack this. Make it up to Sally by breaking into her place, huh? Emergency. Nothing's in here. Charcoal. Huh? An empty pill bottle. What? What do you what do you mean? Did I just get a quest? Unknown location. Uh, fresh ingredients, stick up tea is charcoal. Maybe there's a fireplace. Oh. I guess that's because I was sick and I wanted to make stick up tea. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Chemistry set. Nice. Any pill bottles here? No. Nope, let's hack it, why not? Blower? Oh, that. Okay. <laughs> Scotch. I'm gonna do a pill bottle, nice. I'll find Night Bloom. Yep, we're not gonna be able to do that right now. Everything open. I try not to fuck this up. You need a letter of transit and an old friend. Oh, Sally. Maybe we should just knock first. Like an old Sally. person. So, Sally, who? Arthur! Oh. Come to have a go at me again. I used to think about what I'd say if I ever ran into you again. But, um, being a complete arse was. Sort of improvising there. Look, this is not a spectacular time. You said you know General Bing. Yeah, he's a client, a pharmaceutical client. I haven't had sex with anyone in ten years, and if I did, it wouldn't be with that man. Good. <laughs> did you really come here for a letter of transit? Or did you just need an um, excuse? Well, I, uh, sort of do need the letter of transit. Oh, Arthur. If you're really gonna do something spectacularly stupid, these might come in handy. Uh, 
Thanks. They make your pupils look teeny tiny, just like Joey does, but they have utterly no effect. About the letter? Could you do something for me? Uh, of course. What? I need a bottle of cod liver oil. I'd really like one. Cod liver oil? Why on earth would you want cod liver oil? Like your mum used to torment you with. I wish I could remember her. You know how joy fucks up your memories. Why? Why would you want to remember your mum? It's too much to ask. Well, I was kind of hoping for absolutely I will ask my friend the general for a rotten scrap of paper just for old time's sake. Oh, I'm being an ass again, aren't I? I'll get it for you. The letter. I'm not crazy, but I am always a little extra complicated. complicated. He is to understand. I'll, I'll get it for you. I mean, I'll try. You were always the best of the lot. I've missed you so. I really should go. You, you don't have to. I really really have to. Elsa. Thanks. I'll just go. Oh, I meant to say. Cod liver oil. Dr. Verloc has some at the labs on us glass. Keeps a whole private stash of rare ingredients. I'm sort of persona non grata there. I see I'm the competition. Look, be careful. Well, looks like we gotta go to Hayworth Labs anyway to do this quest. Not only that, but I mean, there was the other uh, thing that we had to do from uh, the puppeteer guy, which I don't think is actually a quest, is it? I don't think I actually have a quest for that. No, no, I don't. Ugh. Well, where's this located at? Oh, that's way. Oh, perfect! The other fucking direction we haven't been in yet. How fucking very joyfully jubilant. Why did Sally kiss me? It's not possible she really wants me, is it? Because that is a consummation devoutly to be wished. And when you really want something that much, you tend to miss the signs that you've lost much of reality. But for one shining moment, I was the hero at the end of the movie. I got the girl, and then why did I pull away off her? Because I was plummeting to Earth, and I had seconds to grab a parachute. I told her I was there about the letter of transit back to the city. She thought I was just there to see her again. Which one is true? I've relied on myself by so many things for so long that I have no longer true trust myself at all. Before the Great Lips debacle, I managed to bring up her mum. Brilliant. She misses dear old mum. The woman tried to poison her. And did in her entire fucking family. And did in her entire family. Okay, damn. Why did I tell her I'd get her cod liver oil? Because she can get a letter of transit from jolly old General Bing. How is that man still a vaguely important person after what he did in the war? And because I can never say no to Sally. I could never say no to Percy. I could, I could say no to Percy, but not to Sally. Why in dog's name can I never say no to Sally? Because she's a woman, my dude. And you're thinking with your dick. Anyway. Fuck. I guess let's just go back here. We'll just talk to this guy, get another fucking quest from him about finding some random garbage. Well, that was scenic. Okay. How do I get out of this one? I don't remember. It's been so long since I've been here. Here we go. Return to Lionel Cashier. Cashier. What are you gonna fucking call him? We need to go, uh. Straight and then down, okay. I wonder if I can go over this now since I'm not, uh, since I'm wearing this maintenance stuff. Hmm. 
Don't know. Can I fix this damn pipe? Smoke here. No. No, I cannot. Do, 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 do. Hey. Have you got the statue? Oh, splendid. Sarah will be thrilled. Here. Oh, I think you'll like this. You certainly know how to handle yourself, don't you? Do you think you could take care of one more delicate matter? Bro. I'll make it worth your while. I suppose I could. The plowboys have been giving me trouble. Want me to pay them for not breaking anything. Normally I rely on the constable, but he thinks he might be called away tomorrow. Could you help? You know, keep the peace. I'll need you here when I open the shop in the morning. Okay. Should clear up soon, I imagine. Lovely day for it. So when do you open? Hold on. Can I help you? Do you have like your times listed anywhere? I guess I assume we just get sent at seven then, huh? Is there a house nearby I can just break into its sleep at? There is. Okay, cool. Specifically, this house right here. Hey, I've already broken into this house before. Excellent. All right, let's go ahead and sleep until six, maybe. And when he woke up, he realized it had all just been a bad dream. What's that? Where do you go? Hey, what are you doing? Excuse. Get him away. Clear up soon, I imagine. Oh, dang. Is uh, does not count. What time is morning? What are you doing in my house? I'm not doing nothing, ma'am. Oh, hey. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Shh. 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 You're fine. You're fine. Okay. Let's go till 4 a.m. Fuck it. And we can just kind of wait outside and loiter around his business, I guess. Oh, yeah. I locked it. Duh. You're a downer. Guess we'll just wait here the shutters rise up, huh? Also, this bothers me right here. Knock, knock, Lionel! I went there at 6th? No, I went there at 7 last time, didn't I? Oh, it doesn't open at 5, it looks like. Unless I gotta, like, leave and come back. Because it's not gonna open up while I'm looking at it. When do you open?!
Because I can just run back in here and... Sleep for another hour. It's been a hard day's night, that was. I thought they opened at 7, but apparently not. <laughs> He's got to open right at 7 then, okay. Well, let's go ahead and just have a sit here, huh? I guess I got there a little bit too late at 7 or something. Luckily, it's only like one. Hold on, let's do it over here. One, two, three, four, about five seconds. Every uh, every little blip there. So that's about uh, hmm, what would that be? Um, about five minutes. We got about five minutes to just wait here and fucking kill time. Actually, no, that'd be an hour. We got a. Uh, about, uh, two and a half minutes. Yes, two and a half. Isn't it indeed? Two and a half. Well. Can I have a torch out? Will people be mad if I have a torch out? I need to find, like, a constable to, like, just shine a light in their face. Also, this looks deadly as hell, huh? Yeah, I guess at night it's it's bad, but uh, during the day it's fine. Weird. Oliver's. What does that say? Oliver's office. Whistles, the foeman bears his steel. I don't know that song. Well, fuck it, let's do a quick lap around the block then. How about that? Yeah! Whee! <laughs> okay. Lovely day for it. Well, these people are just kind of like chilling here at night. Okay. How can I help? You? Oh, you guys gotta press E to actually guard the shop, huh? Oh, look who it is. Well, 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 Lionel. Your constable shrunk a bit, hasn't he? Who's gonna protect you now? You best clear off. My friend's going to settle your hash. Oh, are you? You heard, Lionel. Clear off. You better not be here when I get back with my mates. That was incredible. Thank you. Oh, I hope you can handle yourself as well when there's more than one of them. I'll be fine. Let me just get my caltrops here. There we go. There's a bastard. Get him! I knew you'd come back! Help me! Back for more punishment, are ya? <sighs> uh. <clears throat> Their AI pathing's a little bit bad, is it not? I win! That was incredible. Inspiring. I can't thank you enough. Here, take this. Or you can open just about anything mechanical with this. Is it a safe cracker? 
Or a shot grenade. Ah, a shot grenade. Lovely weather. Afternoon. Oh, a multi-tool. Wait, is that a permanent thing I have now? <gasps> it is! I finally got a multi-tool. Acts as a lock pick and does not degrade? Oh my god. Yes, and I can disarm the tripwire traps now? Fuck. Yes. Dude, bard with me, man. What's your fancy? I don't need anything from you, but I What's actually you're you? you're you're poor as fuck. I don't I don't care. Wow. They're having a bad day, huh? <laughs> now then. That's done. So let's gather some toxic fog, shall we? The hive mind one. There's some toxic fog here. Let's go to the shelter. It'll be closest. I know I said I was going to kind of do it off stream, but I figured we'll do the first one. Kind of see if there's anything special about it, and if there's not, then we'll just end things there. And this one's close by enough to a thing here that we're all good. You guys remember when we had to, like, stop in at a fucking vault every so often just to, like, drop off our... Oops. Just to drop off of our, uh... our gear and stuff. Because we were, like, so... carrying so much stuff. Good times. They were not. They were, they were horrible times. Horrible, shitty times. Let's get the fog sucker out and... let's go ahead and... jog on over towards the fog. Yes, indeed we do. Also, I need some more rowan berries, I think so. It's gonna come out at night. Really? Does it only come out at night? Ain't that about a bitch, huh? This wants to be gathered from here. Hmm. I'm in the garden district now, right? Yeah. No, oh, I'm not. What the fuck's the garden district? Is that one the garden district? Guess. So we'll go back over here. I don't know. I'm all kinds of confused about where stuff's located at. I guess they're Find both kind of the uh, to explore those caves. garden district, right? Who knows? Is it night yet? It's home station. It's 8 a.m. What's in south? Actually, let's see. Is there a bed nearby. Please listen to a personal message for our prudent friend. Do not forget your galoshes. Do not forget your galoshes. Oh, right. Well, it's not exactly chain mail. I look like a complete idiot, but I do feel quite a bit better protected. There's a bed in here. I'm not cooking for you. <laughs> Look, I don't even want to be here. I want to be here, oh, Arthur. You, you <laughs> I want to be here. Sorry. Don't say sorry, Arthur. It's not your fault. <sighs> Let's go right about here, huh? Your move, Samman. Okay. And head south. Fuck, it's 1 p.m. God damn, I thought it was later. 
the fuck? I'm an idiot. Ah, uh, nice. That sevens go right around here. Go right around for midnight, eh? How about that? Getting closer and closer to midnight. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da -ba. I'm gonna just fucking leave out this window here. What's just pointing south and all? the west a little. Here we go. Apparently it comes out at night. Shit. Old Vita suck! No? So we gotta be like on the edge of it then? I just, I had it somewhere. Hold on. There's like specific places I can grab it from or something. Okay, I guess I should pull it back out, whatever. Suck. If some scientist had told me Percy was actually from Mars, I'm not sure I'd have disbelieved him. So maybe, hmm, it's say anything to do it in the village, right? So if I go back to one of these, let, let, let's, just, let's just take a moment here. I wonder if this would count. He wanted it in Hamlin Village, right? Hmm. Um, 11 p.m. If I go out now, I should be able to see the fog next to those pipes. So I should be able to gather it there. So we need to go a little bit north, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. This way. It's gonna be on the next area, so this way here. Right there. Yeah, I can. Excellent. Give it a good old suck. All sucked. Excellent. Now then, I think if we uh, just do that, it'll point us back up here, we can go here, never mind. We're not gonna end things. I thought it was gonna be a lot more of a pain in the ass than it actually was. But um, if it's just boing, 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 why not? It's not the rats you see, it's the rats that see you. Okay, Arthur, no need to get all philosophical on us here. Okay, and then we just need to go north. Actually, it's probably going to be closed. I can probably creep into that house and just take a nap. Yeah, he's closed. Okay. Hey, what? What are you talking about? Why are you all after me? What? What the fuck is wrong? Why are y'all so upset? I've done nothing yet. Oh. I'm wearing a patched suit. Right. Right, I'm an idiot. There we go. All better? Not exactly, huh? There we go. Papa Joy, bastards. Come on. Okay, we're good. Uh, maybe. If I can fucking move. There we go. Ah, fucking hell. I don't want to deal with these, so let's go ahead and just Papa Joy. We're life for noise. Joy. 
Any non-occupied beds up here, y'all? Hey, Knocking your ass out, boy! Hey! No! No! The fuck are y'all doing this time of night? You know what? No. Gonna chill here till they're all done being mad. I'm gonna sleep in this guy's bed. But they were all sleeping and then all of a sudden they got pissed off. Okay. Whatever y'all. Whatever y'all say. We good? We good. Okay. Sleep until seven. Why'd my gas mask break? <laughs> the hell? Abel, once again, all gather around the telly for a rousing round of time. They did it! I know they did it! Are you sure you're feeling all right? Why are y'all mad? Why are y'all mad? Why are y'all mad? Wait, are they mad at me because I have this fucking gas? Am I like given residual gas stuff? Because I'm carrying this fucking thing? I am coughing. Oh shit. Oh sh. Damn. Apothecary! I'm like glitched or something. Lovely day for it. <laughs> That's quite helpful. Now I'll be able to make an antidote for this bloody fog. Oh, and you're welcome to buy from my top shelf. Oh, I don't suppose you could do me a favor. Uh, Mrs. Cheney was here to buy some ingredients. And now I think about it, I'm afraid she might have been up to a little home chemistry. I hate for people to think that I'm brewing experimentals, you know. Sally Boyle doesn't work here anymore. This is a respectable shop. Could you see if she's all right? Discreetly like. And if you could retrieve the uh, ingredients from her house, oh, you'd be doing her and me both a favor. <coughs> I'm dying, help me. Ugh. I don't really know what was top shelf about all that, but okay. Um, what can I sell here? Nothing. Well, actually, I can get rid of these. I don't need these. Although he doesn't really buy them for too much, so I don't really care. Yeah. Okay. Come well, again then. soon. You never know when we'll have something new. I uh. I think we'll end things here for now. I'm gonna make another gas mask because apparently I'm having constant fucking exposure to knocks and gashes or something. I was a big glitch because I like left the thing while in the uh, the fog room or something. I don't know. Grab another mask. That's all. That's all we gotta do is grab another mask. Uh. Peril. Right. You wear gas masks. Duh. There we go. Put on your face. Beautiful. All right. Well. We'll go ahead and end things here, everyone. Thank you all for for watching. And I will see you all next time. Um, I'm going to actually go and find this person's stuff and just take it, unless it's interesting. More than likely, it's going to be like a grab and retrieve type thing. It's not going to be anything like, oh, it's a story or anything cool like that. So we're just going to grab that. We'll be back after that, and then we'll uh, give that guy the stuff. And uh, then we'll kind of just go from there. Yeah. Deteriorating gas mask, you're not. Alright. Anyway, bye for now.